Hey, how you doing? I am Geo. Welcome to the channel. If it is your first time, welcome back. If it is not your first time, and welcome to another music reaction. Today I am doing something again, completely different. I love doing these um sort of something I've never heard, right? Today is Chris Christopherson's Sunday morning countdown. I am using the Rolling Stone top 500 songs of all time. This is number 476. I'm not going through the whole list and I'm not doing them in any particular order. I am using it as sort of a reference point if I'm going through and something catches my eye. Right? Just, just for ideas. Simple as that. Just for things I would not have thought of before. And this, this, this comes into that category. Right? Um, Chris Christopherson, Sunday Morning Countdown from 1970. Right, I know who Chris Christopherson is. He's got a very um, noticeable appearance, right? He, he's got a very um, specific, a very special. What am I trying to say? What am I trying to say? He's got a very notable appearance, Chris Christopherson. I know he is an actor and I know he does music. Although, have I heard any of his songs? I don't know. I don't. Like Chris Christopherson, born in 1936. He's still alive. Wow, I thought he I thought he died a few years ago. 1936 makes him 87 years old. Wow. 87. Is there a third country singer, songwriter, and actor among his me and Bobby G for good time? Sunday morning come down. Help me make it through the night. In 1985, Christopherson joined fellow artists Waylon Jennings, William Nelson, and Johnny Cash in the country music supergroup The Highwaymen. Key creative fortune outlaw. Country music movement is skewed traditional Nashville independent songwriter and producer, right? So they basically went and tried to do their own thing with the Nashville power influence. Um, as an actor, Chris Overson is known for his roles in Pat Garrick and Billy the Kid. No, no, no. Blade, yeah, Blade. I've seen him Blade. In 2004, he was inducted into the Country Music Hall of Fame. Right, so... I'm pretty sure, apart from seeing him in Blade and knowing who he is to look at him, I've never heard his stuff. Right? I know he's a country musician, and you know, my mum used to listen to country, like uh, Conway Twitty and Tommy Wynette, stuff like that. I'm not sure she ever Chris Christopherson. But anyway, this is Chris Christopherson. This is. A Sunday morning come down. Is it? Sunday morning coming down. Coming down. It come down. <laughs> Sunday morning coming down. And by the way, I'm gonna do a live version, right? I'm gonna DM the live version rather than the music video because you know, Chris Christophus. Chris Christophus. One of the best things about my life was the, was the opportunity I had to go around the world and see how people all around the world well, reacted to the Johnny Cash Cash. Memorial. And it was, oh, it, was, it was kind of like the way they do Muhammad Ali. They, for the same reason, they knew that he loved them as much as they loved him. And uh, the best thing I've, I've read since John died was once again said by Bob Dylan, where he said, John was the North Star, and you could get your ship by him. Yeah. By the way, he was, um, he was choking up that, right? He was choking up. Yeah, so it's the Johnny Cash Memorial Concert. This is... Well, I woke up Sunday morning No way to hold my head, it didn't hurt And the beer I had for breakfast wasn't bad So I had one all for dessert And 
then I fumbled through my closet for my clothes and found my cleanest dirty shirt. My cleanest dirty shirt. Then I washed my face and combed my hair. Stumbled down the stairs to meet the day. I'd smoked my brain the night before Cigarettes and songs that I'd been picking But I lit my first and watched a small kid Cussing at a can that he was kicking Hey, quick pause. <laughs> you know what I like about this? In, like, cutting music in general it seems to be like um, you die in fancy lyrics, just literally describe your day. Got up in the morning, brushed my teeth, tooth, washed my face, had my breakfast, walked the dog, had a shower, watched some TV, bargain hunt on ITV. Like you can just describe your whole day until bed, you know, that song, walk out, caught your little fucking guitar. Strum your guitar, what, like jazzy drums in a song, right? Although it's good, it's good, it's like, um, it's, it's good because it's of oh, its simplicity. Most just described a normal day. Then I crossed the empty street and caught the Sunday smell of someone frying chicken. Frying chicken? Breakfast. Then it took me back to something that I'd lost somehow somewhere along the way. On the Sunday morning sidewalk. Wishing road that I was stoned. Is there something in a Sunday? Makes a body feel alone. There ain't nothing short of dying. Half as lonesome as the sound. The sleeping city sidewalk Sunday morning coming down Sunday morning coming down In the park I saw a daddy With a laughing little girl Who he was swinging And I stopped beside a Sunday school song that they were singing Then I headed back for home Somewhere far away A lonesome bell was ringing And it echoed through the canyon Like the disappearing dreams of yesterday The Sunday morning sidewalk Wishing the Lord that I was stoned Cause there's something in a Sunday Makes a body feel alone Yeah There ain't nothing short of dying as lonesome as the sound on the sleeping city sidewalk Sunday morning coming down Mon made a hit song and describing his day and how he feels on a Sunday morning after a Saturday night on the drink. And he made a hit song of it. 
and you've got respect on them, right? I mean, um, I guess that's kind of why people relate to country music because it is real, right? It is real. It's literally life. Like I, I know people joke about like um, my wife ran away with my best friend and my dog got run down and stuff like that. But it's, it is literally it is it is talking to people about their lives, right? It really is. Whereas hip hop and rap seems to be talking to people about where they want to be. Like up here. Lamborghinis, Ferraris and Diamonds. Where you want to be, what you aspire to, country is down here talking about how it is here. Right? Like I said, the man's described a fucking day. Go up in the morning, wash my face, have my breakfast, went for a walk, saw somebody in the park. Feel like shit. Sunday's coming down, Sunday makes you feel bad. Right? You've got to respect that. You've got to respect that. Um, it's always because of Christopherson. Obviously, like, you know, the man was a fair age at this point, right? So his voice wasn't the best. But it was catchy, but not special. Just sounded like a, a country tune. And, yeah. Like I said, you've got to respect the fact that the man wrote about his day and made a hit song. It was catchy. It was good. And... Good for him, but I was, I was 476 in the top 500 songs of all time. So we're still in the top 30, the, the bottom 30. We're still in the bottom 30. But thank you for watching, thank you for listening, thank you for subscribing. To here, 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 here. Thank you for interacting, commenting, talking to me. I appreciate it, I really do. In if you've got any suggestions, leave them. And I'll catch you on the next one.